ostinatos are a technique that are commonly used in music. Basically, one element of the instrument plays a reoccurring pattern, while the other element of the music plays uh, either a contrary pattern or a soloistic, melodic idea. Playing ostinatos requires a great deal of independence. So here are some ways that we can develop that independence. And these exercises will also help in learning other kinds of uh, grooves, and uh, it will also help you attain solo ideas. First thing I'll do is play the double stroke rule with a variety of foot ostinatos. The first one will be playing quarter notes on the bass drum and hi-hat. Next, with also the double stroke, we can add a note on the bass drum, and we play just the foot pattern of what uh, I guess you could use in a bossa nova rhythm. All right, so now we'll add uh, the foot pattern from the balance exercise that I did previously here, and we'll keep the uh, double stroke roll going with this. Now, one of the things that we can do with that pattern, once you've got all these hooked up, is to uh, add open and closed hi-hats to it. So the first uh, open and closed hi-hat would be on beat two, right? And closing it on the eighth note of beat two, and open on beat four, and close on the eighth note of beat four as well. So that'll sound like this. and we add our double stroke roll again. Great, so now we can uh, put, uh, we can start to move that open closed hi-hat feel onto different parts of uh, the beat. Uh, we can now put it on the, uh, the and of one and the and of three, closing on two and closing on four. So it'll sound like this. Now we add our double stroke. Next, we'll put the open uh, hi-hat with the foot on the end of two and the end of four, closing on one and closing on three. So that'll sound like this with the feet. With our doubles. Great. 
Uh, to continue on with that, uh, another great pattern that we could play uh, along with our double strokes is uh, the following. And with our doubles, Next, I'll take that same rhythmic concept, but reverse it. The hi-hat will lead on the feet, and the bass drum will come in second. So it's the same pattern, but just reversed. It'll sound like this. And we'll put our hands on there now. The next pattern is called the Bayo pattern. And it sounds like this. With our hands. that pattern as well. <laughs> 